previously. It has been since December 2018 since I have played this game. And so we go. Hello friends, my name is Renee, and welcome back to Holy Potatoes! We're in space! We, um, are literally picking up right where we left off. I was just so excited to play this game again that, well, here we are, if you couldn't tell by how long the last video was. I have no idea how much I'm going to edit it down because I literally just stopped playing, went and grabbed myself a cup of milk, made my sister some coffee, said hi to my mom, and then came back and started playing. So, yeah. <laughs> no editing has been done yet. Um, Darth Vader, sorry, um, uh, Tarth Tater is busy doing some exercises. So we're going to skip ahead a couple souls. Skip this soul. One soul left. If I skip this soul, will they catch up to me? Zero souls left. They caught it. Only way out now is prepare for battle. Ah, uh, damn. I was hoping that I could leave before they got here, but that's okay. Um, we're going to take you off and put you on. Uh, and I guess prepare for battle. Wait, can I complete objective instead of battle? It's a lot of information to process. Let's just head back to the warp station before deciding where we're being headed. Complete objective. I'm the master. Ha! Those UG ships are dumb. We sneaked past them. Easy. Now let's get out of here pronto. Cassie, I... You... Uh, sorry, what? Oh, I need to know what happened to my galaxy. Mariko said it was the Crimson Galaxy, right? It's not too far from here. I, I looked it up. I know your mom's in the other direction, and we should be looking for her. She might be the key to saving Gigi. But I feel like I need to do this, and if I don't, we might not have another chance. Make a choice. All right, let's check out the Crimson Galaxy. We can head back there after this is all over. Let's go check out the Crimson Galaxy. Thanks, Cass. I just can't stop thinking about it. I just need to see it with my own eyes. I got you, sis. Now let's head there to where this all started. Mm. Yeah. Time to get out of here. Can I just... Are you sure I'd like to warp to the next galaxy? Ah, fuck you. Fuck you and your stupid, stupid eclipse ship. <coughs> no boss battle for me. Aww. Cassie, you okay? You're being really quiet. I'm fine. I'm just thinking. Oh, you poor brain. Your poor brain, don't hurt yourself. Hey. <laughs> We've been to the lot, haven't we? We've met so many new edibles as well. We've learned so many things, but we're still not closer to saving Gigi. We'll find him, Cassie. We'll get Gigi's location out of those punks and rescue Gigi. Yeah, you know there's this really good vegan restaurant around here. Let's go eat there. Ew. Really? Can't we just get some fast food? The magazine says it's really good. I want to try it. Come on, Faye. Go with me. Fine, fine, I'll go with you, but I'm getting fast food takeout later. Familiar faces. Is this supposed to be Family Guy? Alright. Lady Luck 3. Cassie learned a new skill. Hell to the yeah. Faye learned a new skill. Alright, um. I can change who my pilot is, right? She's got. Increases attack for all allied weapons by 40%, but also increases damage taken from weapons by all parts of the ship by 20. What does this do? Lady Luck, increase crit chance. Reduces when enemies attack. Hail Mary. Yep. Do a barrel roll. What does Faye do? That one. Max defense. Intimidate. Uh, she revives the weapons and purifies. Right. I can set Mochi. Wait, hold up, wait, what? I can click on her? Mochi, come back. I had no idea. Time to find some, what is your main issue, cat? What the fuck is happening? Maya is just tripping out. But like, what the hell? 
Get out. Okay, bye. Weird ass cat. All right. Um. Pa padded, neutral, underwater, heavy currents, and explored. This is my objective. Let's go here. Looks like there's a lot of water, some resources, um, biofuel, and nanofibers. Uh, this is antimatter and plasma, right? Yeah. Time to find us some delicious vegan food. This top 100 magazine recommends this crazy good one on the co uh, coconut. Let's go. Yeah, okay. Mm, that was so good. That restaurant was really amazing. It wasn't that bad, I guess, but I'm still getting fast food. Fine, fine. You go order your greasy burger and fries. Yes, I'm going to order my usual Space Supreme set with my smoothie bucket. Maybe I'll get Chucky Nuggets box too. Did you say to full million you're going to order so much? We well, seriously need to discuss your diet. Whoa, what was that? It's starchy and hash again. <laughs> Did you miss us? <laughs> we'll be taking you two in this time. No, you won't. We thrashed you once, we'll thrash you again. You girls better get ready to rumble. I have no idea what voice I gave you. Um, I think I have everybody good to go. Can I rearrange you guys as icons? No, that's really annoying. Um, can't do anything else. Can I click on Mochi? I can. Thank you. Okay, boss. I had no idea that I could pet Mochi. Uh, <laughs> Tarth Tater has the Leroy Jenkins gun. Leroy! <laughs> God damn it. You idiots again. You need to learn to back the spud off. No can do. We need to get some answers. Until we get them, you're going to keep coming we're going to keep coming after you. Oh Christ. Uh right. Um this hits all this hits a single target. Ooh, I have a tin charge. And I've got upgraded uh, accuracy. Whoa, 93% accuracy? Hail to the fuck yes. It's the cat. He's flipping out. That's what I'm trying to figure out. Uh, crit chance 13, crit chance 28. Ooh. All right, let's get you on here. Fire at will. <coughs> oh God, so much damage. I got your back, bro. Oh no. All right, so you go ahead and take down this guy. Since you have such a giant uh, accuracy now with that weapon, that's amazing that I got him, really. And then you go ahead and attack this dude. Oh, and I have another. Um, uh, defense down. Plus 20% for two turns. That's pretty cool. Actually, I should attack with you first. Hold on. So let's hit you here. Hit you here. And hit you here. Hell yeah. Weapon down. I don't need any tricks for you, Bucko. Fix it up real quick, bro. I got our backs. Now you done goofed. Oh, he's like a redneck. Okay. I've never seen Starsky and Hutch. Um, I know that he's invulnerable, but can I hit this guy with her? Or with him? Actually, hold on. Let's hit with you first. And then you. And then you. And I only have two left, so we'll have to wait for the last one. Nope, still invulnerable. Okay. Ow. You are really giving me a good wallop, ain't you? Alright. Go ahead and do this. Nice. Take out all your weapons. Oh no. You got bigger weapons. How's this for a new trick? Cassie, we gotta take out those generators powering that cannon before we get wrecked. Generators? Oh. I see. Firing the huge thing in four turns? Eh, I got you. Don't worry. Uh, first thing we're gonna do is um, purify with the five charge. Uh, 
We're going to fire with her first. His defense down. Then him. Actually. Then him. Then him. And then him over here. Yeah, yeah, I'm sure. Right, wait. You and you. That is defense down is what that gives me, right? Oh, come on. Those are expensive. Load the next generator's hash. Oh boy, I don't want to see the fireworks come out of that cannon. Okay, well, fine. All it does is upgrade the defense taken. Okay, so that's not as bad as I thought it was. There's really no reason to use it. Mm. Oh no, you missed. Why you miss? Bad. Bad missing. You're not supposed to miss. Oh, come on. Now what? That's it. We've got to get this damn thing charged up quicker. Load the big generators we have out back. No excuses. Do it. They can't keep going forever. They have to be running out of energy soon. Keep going. Okay. Um. Boop. 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 And boop. Firing that huge thing in one turn. All right. Everybody attack in case I miss. <clears throat> cool. Now what? Keep going, Hash. We'll get them eventually. We need more generators. Uh, that was the last of it. and That was the main part of the engine. Ha. Screw you guys. I'm going home. I think. Ooh, laser pointer. Like like a pea shooter? I got a new Leroy as well. Hell yeah, it's a level 7 Leroy. That's so exciting. One soul later, 10 souls left. I'm going to have you work on that as soon as I can. Hold on. Um, <clears throat> 97 antimatter and 13 um, ore. All right, what about the laser pointer? Hits, up, hits the target up to five times. Ooh. 54 ore and 53 bio waste. All right, complete objective. Okay, okay. We're beat. We surrender. They sure have gotten stronger. Ha, ah, we win. Now it's our turn to ask the questions. Where's Gigi? He's imprisoned at the Eclipse Secret Headquarters. Which is where? We can lead you there, I guess. Um, could we just ask you one small question? Hey, we're the ones asking questions here. It's just one question. We want to know how Andy is doing. Andy? Andromeda? You mean my mom? We haven't been able to get any information about how she is for a while, and we're a little worried. Yeah, gotta keep an eye on our little sis, after all. You mean Eclipse wants you to find her? No, this is a personal quest. If anything, we don't want Eclipse to find out what we're doing. So, you just want to see how she's doing? I thought you guys hate Gigi. Well, Andy's our little sis, you know? She was just a kid when Gigi left us. We could never be angry with Andy. Not for long, at least. We need to speak with her. So, do you two know where she is? I wish we had time to explain everything, but... I know he's probably also a redneck, but, like, he's got that superhero thing going on. Um, we... What? Who shot us? That... That's the general mothership. Whoa. What? Starchy? Hash? What happened? The ship shot at them? Aren't they supposed to be on the same side? Um, Deneb Rose. Well, hello there, little girls. <laughs> Who are you jerks? We are the three generals of the Eclipse. I am General Vega Canus. Deneb Rose is my name. So happy to meet you. Oh, that was not the voice I gave her. Dr. Altair Gulu, Dr. B. Biology and B. Biotechnology. Pleased to make your 
wait did it's how do I'm I'm there's so many people I've lost my voices in the name of the eclipse you are hereby under arrest <clears throat> what did I do for you better come quickly now or we'll have to blast your ship and pick up from the wreckage you know whatever I give up why did you shoot at Starsky and Hatch aren't you supposed to be on the same side Starchy and Hash, those good for nothing. They are so inefficient and slow. I don't know why Premier Hal keeps them around. They have failed in their tasks. Eclipse has no need for useless fools. I suppose that they could make good test subjects. Okay. Then at least we could give them a good looking into the record. Starsky and Hash would have killed in action. What? How could you do that to your own allies? You should worry about yourselves first before worrying about your enemies. Fire. Our weapons are down. They're firing at us again. Is there anything else we can do? We can't fight back. We need to flee. But what about Starchy and Hatch? We can't just leave them to die. Kit, can I help you? Okay. Okay. Go. go. If we don't run now, we're going to end up just like them too. Activating warp drive. No, Faye, we need to help. Warp drive activated, Cassie. Mm, fine, time to fly. Warp to the next galaxy, but I don't want to warp to the next galaxy. Is that the warp drive? Is that what this is? Can I pet Mochi again? I can. wonder how long it takes me to actually like do the thing. I need antimatter. I want and I want this other Leroy. I have the stone. I want antimatter. Um I need more antimatter. How much does antimatter cost? Okay, what about upgrades? Didn't I wait, hold on. I also got some stuff for that fight, right? Yeah. Got an A laser pointer. Um, is that as good as this? I mean, it could possibly be better than what I've got here. It's a level seven. I'll keep it on the back burner. I want an upgraded succubus, dang it. Ooh, this is a level four part, or a four energy part. All right, I'm gonna sell this. Um, I could make another laser pointer. Uh, six energy costs? Good fucking lord. Okay. I want antimatter. Do, 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 do. Get the anti. Wait, how much do I actually need to make this weapon? Um, I need 97. Jesus, I have. Not 97, that's for sure. Yeah, I need 96 more. Do I have money for that? $4,000 to buy 96 antimatter. All right, whatever. Yeah. Thank you. All right, I need you to build the best freaking weapon you have ever built. Okay. Wait, can I actually train you to be a better craftsman? Or are you fully upgraded? Um. Ooh, I should do this first. It costs three souls though, and I really want that Leroy. <sighs> All right, let's do it. Bless you, bless you. Bless you. All right. Um, can I also go ahead and train you while I'm here? Uh, oh, 35% chance on a fatal attack to reduce HP to one instead. That's pretty cool. Um, more accuracy, critical strike chance. Yeah, let's do that. And can I assign you as well? Combat prowess I can upgrade. Yeah. All right. Three souls. 
All right, let's travel to here. Oh my god, they have antimatter and uh, that here. Uh, bought it for nothing. So annoying. All right, we still have two souls left before you can work on it. So let's go ahead and skip through. Might as well. Cool. All right. Um, do I have money to upgrade you again before I do this? Nah, just for waves. All right. And gave you that. Oh, you already have that. Okay. Uh, Darth Tater back here. Need a pet mochi again. And you here. Perfect. Everybody loves their job. Hello, mochi. All right. Let's go ahead and explore here. I need more antimatter. I like always need antimatter. Pain and suffering are all that await you. Ooh, they have a special weapon. I want it. Is it this? No, it's this thing. The loose cannon. Hmm. Wildly inaccurate. But it does a lot of damage. I probably should take that out first. Wait, hold on. If I hit just these three, then I can hit with more guys at once. <coughs> Higher chance of breaking things. Screw you, my shield is strong. Um, same thing again. 227, 227. I think they're exactly the same. Yep, okay. <clears throat> Fire will. Cool. Aw. Boop and boop. Fire. We're going to use my Leroy at all. Oh. Well, that's just mean. Please die. Okay. Yep, you may leave for 3,000 starch. Oh, right, this is all underwater. I forgot about that. I didn't even explore the other planet. <clears throat> Trader Moe's Emporium. He looks like Beetle the Bard. Or Beetle, Beetle the Bard. Be just Beetle. Familiar jingle rings through the ship. Yes, Trader Moe's Emporium. Oh, not him again. Hello again, Miss Cassie. So lovely to see you again. I got the best prices right here for you. Trader Mill message gestures to two items on the shelf behind him. Firstly, we have the thingamajig. It's a mysterious little contraption that supposedly holds a treasure map inside. If you can open it, that is. Secondly, this thingamabob, this strange device, could lead you to a fountain of everlasting youth if we figured out how to operate it. Cassie listens to Trader Mill speak enraptured. Fader rolls her eyes behind Cassie. You can get one of these two items. For only 7,500 starch. Or, turning to Faye, the trader most drugs, you could be a spoiled sport and not buy anything. I only have a 1,182 uh, starch, Cassie. Cassie's eyes flip from one item to item and open her mouth. Um, I kind of want a thing of a jig. I mean, it's seven grand, I know. A very good choice, Miss Cassie. Trader Mo exchanges the thingamajig for the starch and leaves happy. Cassie begins fiddling with the thingamajig, trying to get it open. Seriously think this thing could have a treasure map inside? Come on, it's all about the mystery. You'll figure it out. Me. <laughs> I spent 7500 on a useless tool, but it's okay. Faye's fluffy. At the first sign of glorious mega fast food chain signage, Big Bane Burgers, Faye suggests very passive-aggressively that they should make a stop at the drive through Cassie shakes her head or a glutton of a sister and concedes. I'll have an Adam Burger and a Nano Soda. My sister will have the Galactic Space Supreme set with extra sauce on the side and Cosmo Smoothie Bucket with limited edition fluffy toy. Chimed in Flake Leafly. No, oh, thanks. It's your lucky day, ma'am. We have one last toy in stock. Please proceed to the- Ah! Alarm, Cassie revs the engine and races to the cashier counter around the corner and sees a mass pumpkin on a space bike holding the cashier at gunpoint demanding the last fluffy. Faye, famous and clearly on edge, yells out. Uh... Leave the poor lady alone. The mass pump and glowers and snatches the fluff oh god, fluffy before getting away on its space bike. Faye heaves a sigh of relief and approaches the waitress. Are you okay? 
quivering, the waitress grabs hold of Faye and gushes. Yes, thank you for saving my life. It's gotten really dangerous around these parts. Please take me with you. It isn't very safe for wherever we go end up going. Faye looks over at Cassie, who is about to burst at the seams from stifling a laugh. That's okay. I know I'll be safe with you two. You especially. She pushes heavily and turns her gaze away coyly from Faye's. Cassie, unable to stop herself from laughing any longer, bursts out laughing as she welcomes the young lady aboard the Spud Bunny. Faye sheds a single sad tear for the fluffy she will never have. Emma Pebble joins her crew. Emma Pebble. What does she do? I guess I'll find out later. Abandoned cargo. Our scanners are picking up a cargo ship. Looks like it's been abandoned for a while now. Huh? Really? Let's go in and see what we can find. It's probably been looted already. Still want to go in? Of course. Cassie and Faye park near the cargo ship and enter. Most of the things on the ship have already been looted, but they manage to find a well-hidden cargo hatch that has not been opened yet. They find a batch of cargo that fetches them a good price when they send it to the hub market to be sold. Ooh, 3,000 starch. I almost got my starch back from the asshole that made me buy things. Uh, sorry, I was looking at something. Oh, no, I didn't see what that said. Uh, what the hell? Phoenix fire, okay. It's all oh, splash damage. All right, so I need to take you out first. Go ahead and focus my energy on here. Wait, hold on. You first, and then you. And then you. Fire! You're so weird looking. Ouch. Okay. You are next. All right, and because why not? <coughs> Everybody, hell yeah! Five, almost six thousand starch to get away from me. Yeah, please be gone. <coughs> and I got an Apollo shard. Oh, it's another one of you. All right. Another phoenix. All right, all right, all right. All right. So your accuracy is pretty good. Let's see if you can do that. This is fine. Oh, come on. Your accuracy is so high. What happened? Oh, your accuracy is 83. What happened? Do I have debuffs on me? I have no idea. I don't want to see what happens if I turn on autopilot, but at the same time, I really like focusing certain areas. So let's not do that. <coughs> okay, cool. All right, I'm gonna send two of you here, and the other two here. Both of them missed. Are you absolutely serious right now? Really? You're kidding me, right? What is your accuracy level? 88? Oh, all of my accuracy is down. What's up with that? Huh. Must be the bubbles. Yep. Lowers the accuracy of all weapons. Makes it really hard to hit anything. Just fire everything. One of them's got to hit, right? Ooh, did they to their hull? Set. <laughs> I killed their shield, too. And I got a phoenix. Part. That's pretty legit. Cool. And I got another bat, an Apollo, and a phoenix fire. Phoenix fire is pretty legit. I'm really excited about that. And I got a thingamajig. And we got a new crew member. Didn't we get a new crew member? Cool. Oh. Wave specialist. You're interesting. Okay, hold on. So what do you, like, do? You're a mermaid. <clears throat> oh. You're interesting. Okay. Mochi. Okay. Cool. I got so much antimatter from that. I wish I would have just gone there instead of buying it. 
All right. Well, it's a good thing because I need it anyways. Whoa. Heals all. And it's a wave. And she's a wave master. Mm, maybe. I'll build it. Let's see what happens. One still left to build. Um, I would really like to upgrade your combat again. Mm, give you a critical percent chance instead, I guess. Can I upgrade yours? Uh, let's give you caretaker and I think I can upgrade you to steady hands yeah cool all right and you guys are all training so I can't really do anything here I sh really should have done this probably <laughs> um but too late now mm, okay you're building that weapon you are so strange looking um, there are not very many planets here, are there? Hostile. You're neutral. You're out of range. I haven't explored you either. Could use more antimatter. It comes up with, it, it's like plasma guns. It's awesome. But two of my weapon specialists are out. I don't really want to go... All right, hold on. I can probably just use you guys for now. Just until he gets out, which is fine. There we go, and we're going, we can explore while they're doing their thing. Yeah, everybody's got a job now. And I've got plenty of fuel, let's go. Hmm, they have a special weapon, I want it. Whoa, what the fuck? Souls to recharge from the enemy when attacking the hull, but it's stopped by shields. Uh, your splash damage, your splash damage, and you are just unique. Okay. So. So you've got the Leroy. My accuracy is at 85. That's not terrible. But we are going to attack with these guys first. Wait, not you. Got a shield up. Fire. Hmm. Okay. Cool. You moved it. Perfect. <coughs> Punk rock bombardier. This didn't really have too much, uh, like, talk beforehand. Alright, one of these should explode, right? Or both. Oh, just one. Okay. Ha, screw you. Why do you have a bonus? Oh, it's because he's a laser specialist, right? Um, yeah, you can escape for 5,000 starch. That's fine. No. Oh. Uh-oh. The flare disco song intensifies. Um. More extractors. 79 plasma. Hail yes. While roaming the skies above Patan, the ship's onboard metal detection system picks up with signs of an ornate chest half buried on the side of a hill. A treasure chest. There's gotta be treasure inside. Bring it up, Faye. Yeah, sure. Aww. Oh, you guys nothing. Is that a bomb? Oh, no. Throw it out. Throw it out. Eh. Minus 590 whole HP. It was worth the risk. <laughs> uh, martial arts manuals. Hey, young lady, I can see that you have the potential to be a great martial artist. Do you want to buy a martial arts manual? I've got a great selection, and only at the high affordable, highly affordable price of 13,560 starch. Cassie stares at the haggard, bearded old edible, offering her a handful of books. She looks thoughtfully at the books. It's a lot of money, but a C 
seems important. Cassie hangs over a small amount of starch. Takes a martial arts manual. Receive weapon part. Terry spirit level seven. Uh, from the old edible. She runs back to the ship and shows it to Faye, who sides in Faye's vault. She grabs the book from Cassie and fl quickly flips through it. It's a scam, Cassie. There's no martial arts manual. That's a blueprint. Huh, that's useful. Tarot spit level seven. Hmm. Hey, it's Trader Mo again. Trader Mo's here! Uh, a necklace of youth, able to have been made by a god and keep its wearer young and beautiful forever. Um... And the others are bringing invincibility, crafted and enchanted to make you unseen to veggie eyes when you place it in your mouth. Two legendary items can be 10,000 starch each. This is an amazing deal considering the rarity in the and considering the rarity and mythical status of these items. Or, well, Trader Mo looks away in utter disappointment. Tears in his eyes. We only have 1,723 starch, Cassie. Cassie, heartbroken at seeing Trader Dormat. Trader Joe so upset says, eh. Faye quickly pulls Cassie aside and covers her mouth. I'm really sorry, but maybe not this time. Perhaps next time. Trader Mo leaves with a disappointed look on his face. Cassie is upset she didn't manage to buy anything this time. Aw. I'm so sad. I'm sorry, Trader Mo. Souls, souls, give us your souls. You're creepy. Ooh. You have a Leroy. Um, I'm gonna guess that's around your hole. So I'm gonna put <coughs> your lead away first. That's gonna do a shit. Oh my. Oh my. Um. Nice. My porthole, what are you doing to me? <clears throat> Fire at will. What do these have splash damage or something? Bye-bye. I'm so merciful. Salvage the bat. Oh, I didn't get the Leroy. I wonder if it's the last part that you destroy that you get. I didn't consider that. Hmm. Cool. Got a lot of antimatter. Ooh. Hmm. Cool. You guys are still doing things. I'm going to have you build more things. Let's have you build. Attacks all targets still two times. It's base damage to holes and inflicts defense down on accuracy for three turns. Oh my god. It does not do a lot of damage though. I bet it'd be um, very sellable. Uh, yeah. Let's put you here. Cool. Uh, four souls left. Let's go ahead and... Eh. Now, I could get more resources, but they're still doing things. Hmm. Alright, let's go ahead and explore again. It's one soul. <laughs> Alright. Alright. So, destroying this last will give me that weapon, right? That's what I'm going to try and do. <coughs> Holy fuck. And 
die. All right, let's see. Yep, please leave. And let's see. Candy's box. Okay, so the one I, I took to me, this is the 13th episode I've made of this. I have so many hours in this game. <sighs> Looks like you're in a bit of a pickle. All right, what is your special weapon? Stone cold is pretty cool. What? Oh, it's another grave digger. Kind of meh. Uh, it's a wave that hits all. A 10% chance to bash. Yeah, I don't really care for any of these, but this one will probably sell for more. So we'll destroy these first because they hit all anyways. Do, 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 do. Bop. 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 Nice. Uh-oh. Uh. Hmm. Screw you. Damn it. Okay, that is extremely useful, actually. Um, I might have to I might have to rethink me not having a grave digger. Really now. Now oh, I missed. Oh, I guess I'm getting this one. Fire! That was really dumb of me. I should have fired with more weapons. Okay, it worked out. 6,000 stars, you may leave. Be gone. Cool. Hmm. Another strange chest. Sure, bring it up. Oh, another bomb. More hull damage. Dang. Oh well. What do we got now? Want to be the very best. Wait, don't go there. It's dangerous to go alone. What? Who? Cassie looks around and spots a large box attached to a post. The voice comes from a speaker attached to the box. I'm Professor Conifer. Wild Podemon look in the tall grass you see. You need to have a Podemon of your own to protect you. Podemon. Tall grass. What the spot are you talking about? Here, I have a few Podemon. You can pick one. The panel on the box opens and three small colored balls roll out. The balls open up and three strange creatures hop out of the balls onto the ground before Cassie and Faye. Oh, they're so cute! What? How did they fit in there? These three Podemon are Brockosaur, Squirt Turnip, and Chillimander. Go on, pick one. Ooh. Ooh. I've always been more of a, of a Bulbasaur person. But I really like Charmander, and Squirtle is just so cute. I've always been a Bulbasaur person, though. Grass all the way. Uh, all the way. All the way. Brockosaur hops forward happily, growling softly. Cassie, ha Cassie happily pats it on its head. The other two creatures are absorbed back into the balls. Faye picks one up, the, up one of the balls and stares at it incredulously. Oh my god, I can't talk. What? It's a Brockosaur. It will protect you as you travel the world and try to become the very best Pokemon trainer. Your very own Pokemon legend is about to unfold. A world of dreams and adventures of Pokemon awaits. Let's go. What? Wait, what? Pokemon trainer? We never said anything about wanting to be this Pokemon trainer thing. The voice from the speaker fades away, leaving Brockosaur behind. Cassie looks at Faye, her eyes big and round, the Brockosaur in her arms. Can we keep it? Please, 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 please. Cassie. <sighs> Faye sighs and face palms. Green Pokeball plus one. I'm going to be the very best. Eclipse blockade. Oh no, it's an eclipse blockade. How are we going to get past that? We could try to find a way around. There doesn't seem to be too many guards around. Or we could pay a guard to bribe and let us through. Maybe I'll accept starch. I'll find a way around. Because I don't want to give up my starch. Cassie and Faye sneak away from the blockade and attempt to find a way around. They manage to find an unguarded spot and successfully sneak past the eclipse soldiers and fly away. See, they flew away. Girl. Pain and suffering are all their way you. Alright. Uh Jean Bean. It's a level seven. Mm. Mm. Alright, let's take you out first. Just in case you guys actually critically hit, I'm gonna aim two places. I don't understand why the shield 
Is the shield covering everything? Can you do that? Or does it just automatically fight the shield anyways? Oh. Ow. Boop. And boop. Yep. Bye. Could have killed you in one more turn. I got a bat. Exploration complete. Da -da 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 got a panties box. I got a stone. I got stone cold, and I got the bat, and I find a green photo ball. Cool. And I got a lot of antimatter. I should be good on antimatter for a while now. Let's go, Brachosaur. We only have three souls left. Yep, obviously. And the stalwart bat is ready. Oh, go back to the ship. All right. Um, we have so much antimatter now. Uh, okay. What would be good to sell? I really don't care for the panties box. I think I could uh, build it and then sell it. All right, uh, travel back to the hub. Hubba, 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 hubba. Oh, I should have done a research that was dumb of me. All right. Training is ready. Everybody's happy. All right. Can I do the training that I want to do is the question. Um, greater refinement. No, I cannot. I can probably do it if I sell my uh, stuff, though. Um, this one, right? So. Oh. It just gives me one. Yeah, you can have that. Bye. Um, I'm not using another bat right now. This Leroy is... Mm, uh, six energy, and it's not as good as mine. I mean, it does have slightly more damage. The accuracy is better, though. Hold on. I gotta look at the accuracies of these two compared. Alright, um... So this one is a B. <laughs> it's got an 85% accuracy. Um, six energy, though. Uh, 497 to 923. Ah, uh, that's quite a bit more damage. The accuracy is just as good. All right. Let's take this off and put the new one on. All right, what about my pea shooter? It's still the best, right? Um, what about the, this rail gun? 333 to 407, gate crasher. Rail gun. Um, Could have two Leroy's. A little silly though. Uh, marks targets. I mean, I could have two of these. And then my pea shooters. That's the thing I could do. Uh, let's go ahead and put you here. And sell the succubus. Um, kind of mad about this. I think I just built it to sell it. Uh, the bat's pretty cool, but bye though. Um, laser pointer. Universal remote for cats. Okay. Got a lot of health. Cool, cool. Take all my things away from me, please. 
Um, I should keep this extra pea shooter just in case. But otherwise, yeah, I'm good. Um, coming back to the hub, I need you to build another thing for me, Cassie. I want to sell things. Do I have the stuff for this? Oh, definitely. Not Cassie. Uh, uh, what what was your name? Barbary. You cheese. I get it. All right. Um. I'm pretty happy with your stats. Uh, also, I would really like to do this. I'm gonna assign you. Let's go ahead. Uh, fuel calls for traveling is pretty cool, but I kind of want to grab this. Um, because, yeah. I have money for another one, too. I really should do another one. Traveling range is pretty legit. I think I might do pra traveling range. Um. Wait, where'd it go? There we go. And I can stick uh, you here. I said I could stick you here. <laughs> Thank you. Alright. Can I do more stuff with you? I could get your high roller again. That'd be pretty cool. Uh, can I do more stuff with you? Uh, second win. I can do your high roller again. You're pretty good where you're at. What do you do? Learn a new skill? Yeah, okay. Awesome. Everybody's doing a thing. Go back to the hub. Um... Do I have money to upgrade stuff? <gasps> I can do a new weapon. Oh, it's still four slots, though. Damn it. Ah... Uh, Living quarters and get more crew members. That's pretty legit. Um, weapon HP increased. Yeah, alright, let's go ahead and do this. I want another one. I also want to get this. In case I, uh,. In case I come across more extra stuff. I have more things that I could sell. I'm kind of just mad about. I could sell this gun that I'm building right now. Skip one. Cool. You have one soul left. Um. Don't have enough to build you. Don't have enough to build you. I do have enough to build you, though. Cool. Also, I need to reassign you. Get... Stop it. Um, which has the... You have 80... They both have 85% accuracy. Which one has the higher crit chance, though? Uh, you do. Which one are you again? 14 crit chance, 10%. Okay, so I'm gonna put the higher accuracy guy here. Um, you're fine there. I only have one soul left. Uh. And I don't have a complete button, so I can't just nope out. Oh, ochi. How do I. Can I click on anybody else? No? I just, they're all dancing. Have you guys seen that meme? Wow, he can really dance. Wow, he can really dance. <laughs> That's how it feels. Everybody is dancing. This is how we do things on our ship. We just dance our troubles away. We dance ourselves to victory. All right, well, I'm in this episode here. Yet again, it's been really fun. When I come back, I will be going to the next galaxy, I guess. So, um, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you in the next episode. Whatever I decide to make. Lunar Knight signing out.